गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न द नेक्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ राइटिंग एडवर्टीजमेंट्स इन द प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी लर्न अबाउट द स्टाइल ऑफ राइटिंग एडवर्टीजमेंट्स एंड नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न लैंग्वेज ऑफ राइटिंग एडवर्टीजमेंट्स इन द प्रीवियस लेक्चर्स of this particular module english for banking and industries we learn about writing advertisements print media electronic media and the notice agenda and minutes how you are going to write down notice agenda and minutes is the part of english for banking and industries so now we are going to learn the part of writing advertisement the next part that is language of advertising the language used in every advertisement should be catchy persuasive and motivating it should evoke the desired response it should have certain word triggers it should aim at bringing about a close association of a particular quality or state with a particular product it should make make us believe that we are buying success health vitality instant loveliness and tingling freshness in the same way when we buy vimal life boy glucondi or such other products see how the language of advertisement is matters much in every advertisement there is a catchy and persuasive and motivating words so it is the important part of advertising that is the language so here are the examples of advertising of vimal life boy glucondi or such other products the task of creating the language of advertisements requires creativity see creativeness of language is the most important part in writing advertisements for the particular purpose or of advertisement of the particular product in the <coughs> particular advertisement you are going to use not only the creativity in the structure but the creativity of the language as well so language of advertising is the most important part in this particular module for your learning there is no need to follow the rules and conventions of language while writing an advertisement this is the most important part so how you are going to learn it and read it and try to create an advertisement is the most important part though you are go you are going to write down a language of advertisement without any conventions and rules and regulations you may coin a telling phrase an epigram or a rhyme to drive your message home there is a large variety of linguistic de devices used in advertising it would neither be ad advisable nor possible to give <coughs> here a sample of each device however a few samples of certain often used devices are given below just to give a flavor of variety in the language you can use for advertising see <coughs> this is the most important part language of advertising there are epigrams that again particularly the language which is a used different devices praises and give us a particular message of in the advertisement see that's why the language of advertising is the most important part in the writing advertising so that's why it is called 
a skill of language next part characteristics of language used in advertisements it is loaded with meaning loaded with mean, meaning it means there are the catchy words and emotive words we can use it and those words are loaded with meaning there are multiple meanings to it next aimed at catching attention stimu stimulating interest arousing desire full of imperative structure so this is the important characteristics of language used in advertisements next part to make use of effective language in ad you have to be well acquainted with certain characteristics of language of advertisement study the following characteristics of language of advertisement there are six characteristics are given coining coinage of new words alliteration use of vocabulary in unusual context next parallelism rhyme etc so the first part of it coinage of new words utterly butterly delicious this is the example of amul butter advertisement of amul butter we immediately remember it that's why it is a catchy one it is a coinage of new words next limka nokia soft drink justly good apple juice so here after ed there is a attached a ly this is a coinage of new words chocolatious it is different from delicious but it is example of drinking chocolate skin maggi face cream see how it is used and coined new words for the advertisement next part next examples that is ambiguin it is the example of sarees advertisement of sarees tie queue it is a example of tie next trendy prints dress material touch happy textures it is exam advertisement of fabric next example of advertisement no icky plasticky smell water gels next example it is about the alliteration this is the characteristics next characteristic and examples are here given fragrant or fresh peel the lime fresh as nature itself fruity fruity your lime shampoo see use of the alliteration repetition of the alphabet f next fashion fabric light as air depends on climate by dr a next example dashing debonair and distinctive it is advertisement of suitings next example of dress material dancing designs that dazzle her the repetition of the d puts the crunch into the brunch sandwich toast maker advertisement the zing thing that is the advertisement of cold drink this is the examples of alliteration search out more examples of alliteration and try to write down and try to create a new <coughs> line new sentence of advertisement next characteristics use of vocabulary in unusual context let's see here are the examples take ears of your feet it is example of footwear beautiful skin is something you wear 24 hours a face cream lip service with difference it example of lipstick if only your finger had bristles toothbrush a fragrance as precious as gold this is the advertisement of talcum powder for that dream sleep that you never dream of this is the example of mattress and next characteristics parallelism that is neighbors envy owners pride that is tv's advertisement 
Next advertisement example of foundation cream that is satin is the way it feels, flawless is the way it looks. Next example colors that command attention, texture that mean business. This is the example of fabric, advertisement of fabric. Next example light as mist, soft as spring. This is example of fabric. How the language of advertisement is used here is the most important part. So, next is rhyme. All of you know all these figures of speech and you can understand how it is used. Next example, rhyme. Old mother, her bard, went to the cupboard to fetch her poor doggy a bone. Said the pup, I want bread with that great amul spread. To which very faithful I have grown. So, this is example of butter of Amul. Next example of rhyme, which is used for the advertisement, that is breakfast every day with Nescafe. Any moment of the day, enjoy your cup of Nescafe. See how it is written. Next example. Do not cry, my child. I know the world seems strange and new, but you, you are safe and in my arms. See this advertisement. Next example. No harm will ever come to you. Johnson and Johnson baby oil and soap, etc. Example. Next example. Of tea bags, dip, dip, dip. If you want it stronger, deep a little longer, deep, deep, deep. See how it is the rhymes are used for the advertisement. There are examples and used of figures of speech. More of figures of speech you can use for advertisements. Here the six examples are given. First is coinage of new words. See how you are going to use the, uh, coin the new words for the advertisement. Next, alliteration, use of vocabulary in unusual context. Again, parallelism, rhyme are the examples and particularly used the characteristics of language of advertisement. These, with the help of these characteristics, you can create an advertisement. Try to create an advertisement and learn the skill of writing advertisement. So, this is the last part of your, this module number 7, English for Banking and Industries. So, how you are going to use the language for English for Banking and Industries. There are types. First is Notice, Agent Dominates. Second part, the writing and advertisements. So, in that way, you are going to learn this particular module and try to develop your writing skill and read the particular structure of advertisement and notice each of the minutes. Try to follow it and practice for it. In the next lecture, we will see the next part of your reading comprehension from module number fourth or that is the as per your syllabus for your semester fourth that is module number fifth module number fifth part b module number six part b and c module number seven part b and module number eight part a and b so till then stay safe stay home